Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to take the East Rim Trail up to the Jolie Gulch viewpoint here in Zion National Park. Now, this is a, definitely an underrated hike. It is spectacularly beautiful here. There are no crowds on this hike, and uh, even though I could hear some people talking in the background, you're just minutes off of the uh, road to get to the trailhead, but you are eons away from all of the crowds in Zion Valley, and it is breathtaking. Watch the video and you will see what I'm talking about. Now, if you wanna do this, I have a full guide on hikingguide.com where I'll talk about where to park. I have maps and all of the logistical stuff. And uh, before we get rolling, big, big thank you to everyone who supports this website. I could not do without you. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And uh, if you wanna say thanks for the video, just give me a little thumbs up and it'll uh, do the trick. All right, guys, uh, hopefully you can do this video, your, or sorry, do this hike yourself, but watch the video and you will see what I mean. The hike starts at the East Rim Trailhead, which is just past the east entrance to the park. And the trail starts just past this gate. You can see there's a paddock on the right. This used to be ranch lands before it became a national park, I think in 1919, so over 100 years ago. And you continue a little bit, you will see a sign for the East Rim Trailhead. And that's the, the basically the trail we're gonna take all the way to the viewpoint. And right away, you can see there are mesas. It's, it's sort of, uh, your head will be on a swivel looking back and forth at all of the classic Zion rock formations here, the sandstone, this weathered and worn sandstone which surrounds you. And I want you to notice as we go through this, there's no other people here, just, uh, just me. Here we are entering the Zion Wilderness, which is a wilderness area within the park. If you don't know what a wilderness area is, I have a video on that. And this section of the hike goes up along Clear Creek and Clear Creek Canyon, which is basically a wash, usually uh, devoid of water. And we're gonna cross over the creek and its tributaries like here, a couple little gullies, and you can see the trail always continues on. But real easy to follow. The East Rim Trail is a major uh, trail here in the park. Now at the end of Clear Creek, we're going to do this sweeping left-hand turn and start heading up Cave Canyon, which is this. And Cave Canyon definitely feels much different than the more desert-like Clear Creek. It's very lush. Obviously, there's water flowing down there. And again, you have these incredible rock formations and weathering of rocks. That's just a uh, quintessential Zion topography here. Now at the end of going up the canyon, we're gonna do a really long sweeping switchback and kind of cut back on ourselves and go up along uh, the upper part of Cave Canyon, which is down there on the left. More nice views into it. And there's some climbing on this, but the climbing's also gradual that you don't really feel it along the hike. And I'll have a elevation profile in the guide if you wanna check that out. And then we're going to twist around on this old wagon road. And now we're going to be looking across uh, the canyon where Clear Creek is as we continue along. And then we're going to get to our first viewpoint of Checkerboard Mesa, which is in the distance. If you want to see that up close, there's a little pullout on the side of the road uh, just past the trailhead. When you drive again, you can check it out there. But soak in the mesa and then continue uphill for a little bit. And again, this is a wagon road. You can see it's a wider trail here. And then this trail will go uh, sort of to the right and then we'll go along Jolly Gulch. And I've heard it pronounced Jolie or Jolly by rangers, so choose your, choose your pronunciation, run with it. And then we have a little bit of a downhill section once we go down to the uh, viewpoint by the gulch. And after a little bit of downhill, you'll see there's a Park Service sign telling us we are at the gulch. And then we have this viewpoint right here where we could see down into the gulch. Okay. And there's actually a horror story about this uh, waterfall and cliff right here. And I'll put that in the guide if you want to read about the uh, kind of infamous horror story associated with this spot. But anyway, stick around. I'll show you what this looks like on a map. All right, so this is a hike. It's an out and back. We're going to basically go up to the viewpoint and then come on back down. The hike starts at the East Rim Trailhead, and here is the entrance booth for the east entrance. So once you come through there, you turn up this uh, little dirt road here. It's well marked. Don't go over here to the ranger station. Just go straight to the parking area, and then we start the hike. Now, this is uh, Clear Creek over here, which is a wash. You can see it winding its way up. We're basically following that for a little bit. 
Here's uh, Jolly Gulch over there, which we'll, we'll check out a little bit later up from the top, but we're gonna go up it through here. And we're gonna follow Clear Creek all the way up until we get to uh, Cave Canyon, which is this canyon over here. And then we do that sweeping turn to the left. We go up Cave Canyon, here's that sweeping uh, switchback. And then from here, we continue to climb up above the canyon. And then we get to this first viewpoint right here where we could see Checkerboard Mesa. If I go up a little bit, there's the Mesa right there. And actually the road goes down here as it goes down to Zion Canyon, the main part of Zion Canyon. But you're gonna get, get great views down um, the canyon here, Clear Creek and the Mesas. Now from this viewpoint, where'd I go? Here we go, I lost the viewpoint there. We're gonna do this turn and head into Jolly Gulch, which is right down here. And you can see this is the top of the climb, then we have a little bit of a gradual downhill. And here you can see the gulch, let's see if we can go in there. These are satellite photos, but still pretty cool. It gives you an idea. It's about 200 feet or so down. And you can actually just walk up the gulch too and go in there, but obviously this is not go down from here. You can canyon here from here, but you could go down from the part we were at earlier. But from up here, you have the viewpoint. If I swing us around, I look at these trees. I never zoomed in on a tree like that in Google Earth. And we pull back like this, you could see there's the gulch. You're basically right at the edge, so don't go close, but you could see it's a pretty intense spot here if you look down. And then from here, you're gonna get views down into the gulch as well. And you can actually see the start of the trail, which is right back down here. And uh, that's the hike. And if you wanna do some other hikes in Zion, just go to hikingguy.com where I have uh, some other options for you. All right, guys, I'll see you out there. Thank you.